I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get on with my plan. It's a rusty old padlock, and it's locked. It's a rusty old padlock, and it's locked. Open up. Federal agents. Keep your panties on. I'm coming. Whatever you're selling, I'm not buying. So take your dime store suit and good news pamphlets and stick them where the sun don't shine. Ransom the Clown? I heard you know about a body by the bridge. Jeez, no foreplay, Red? You don't beat around a bush, do you? Not my style. You can ask your questions, Toots, but I'm not saying I'll answer. What do you know about the body by the river? What body? Earlier this evening, we found a body down by the bridge. We're investigating, and I was told you might have some information for me. Nah, I heard some sirens before, but I figured they were headed for the mansion mansion. That's where most of the f***ed up stuff happens. What weird stuff do you know about at the mansion? You want to find out about the mansion mansion? You're gonna have to talk to some other idiot. I keep to myself and the town folk leave me the f*** alone, thank you. I'm not about to rock the boat. I don't pay rent here, and I can't go anywhere else after my next wife took me for everything I had. We heard you don't get along with the locals. Given my creepy clown face and Paul Jean for abusive name calling, it's not made me a popular community figure. No. But I don't need the validation of these small town losers. I'm Ransom the Clown. I was on the Tonight Show. I'm. Great! What do you know about Chuck? Chuck? As in, Chuck, my factory is too good to make toys, Edmund? Didn't know the pompous well myself, but I knew his brother Franklin. Weedy guy. Total Scared to stand up to his big brother, even though the family business was in the crapper. How do you know Franklin Edmund? We were supposed to go into business together. My act was about to go bigger than Jesus. I was a hit on The Tonight Show. I was on my way to the top, so we figured why not cash in with a little merchandising. Franklin wanted to get the pillow factory into making toys, so it seemed like a good fit. What kind of toys were you planning to make with Franklin? Jeez. How do you get by in life without brains or beauty? Isn't it obvious? We were gonna make Ransom the Clown insult dolls. Would have been great if Franklin hadn't bailed on me and gone missing before we signed the contracts. I could have been rich by now if that little toady had grown a backbone. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back. Whatever, Red. Not like I'm going anywhere, but you're not getting inside without a warrant. I'll just leave it where it is. That way. It says, need help playing Thimbleweed Park? Call the fully automated Hinttron 3000, trademark, at 4468. It's a Ransom the Clown comic, issue number one. It's my cheese. I'm letting it age. My old circus poster featured the amazing Ransom the Clown.
It's my joke book, but there are it's my joke book, but there are four pages missing. It's a page from my joke book. Come back here. Hey! Stop! Damn broken window. I can't leave the circus till I feed Lil Beeper. That's, that's where the midway used to be. Now it's my garbage dump. It's empty. The rats and I cleaned it out years ago. Here you go, little beeper. Enjoy your crap. Got the page stuck back into the joke book. Got the page. It's a page from my joke book, but there are two pages missing. Got the page stuck back into the joke book. That's a rare first edition of my... My old circus poster featured the amazing Ransom the Clown. So I don't like to make my bed. Package held at Thimbleweed Park Post Office for Ransom the Clown. I'm not gonna search this.
Hope you're enjoying our fine weather. It's closed. Sorry to hear about your Uncle Chuck. Thanks. Uncle Chuck was a complex person. I was just kidding. I'm not sorry. He was a... <sighs> Please leave me alone, Ransom. Have they tried to pin this murder on you yet? Not yet, but I don't trust that Agent Ray. What about Agent Reyes? He seems okay, but there is something familiar about him. I hear you know 6502 assembly language. Yeah, I do. Why? I just wanted to see if you're the biggest nerd I've ever met. And proudly. What's up with those two agents? I don't know. Something is fishy. What do you think of in-jokes and fourth-walling? I'm asking as a professional comedian. I don't think you're either of those things, Ransom. Off, Dolores! Off, Dolores! Off, I'm tired of talking. as far to the left as I can move it. I'll have to push it to move it to the right. stuck back into the joke book. Buy me some kombucha? Ransom, what are you doing here? The latest issue of Humongous Honka Honkas won't be mailed for at least another week. You, George. Can't a clown visit the post office without the third degree? Sheesh, someone woke up on the wrong side of the big top. Let's try that again. What can I do for you, Chuckles? Hey, George, you lazy f I want to pick up my package. Let me see that. Okay, one moment. And next time, 
deliver it to me in person. What do you think I pay my tax dollars for? You haven't paid your taxes in years! Who do you think sorts all outgoing mail? Well, f you. It's addressed to me. Ransom the clown. There's a note inside. Dear Mr. Clown, we hereby return your defective samples. The wallet seems to be made out of a rare endangered species of bird, and the candy dispenser sparks whenever you use it. Please do not contact us again. What a bunch of wads. Thimbleweed Park guided tours? You look like you're hitting the willy sauce harder than I am. Well, you look like your liver's about to fail. So I guess we both look like... I don't really blame you for drinking. Oh, you don't? Nah. With your ugly face, I drink every time I pass the mirror. <laughs> You're one to talk. You got any booze to spare? If I did, it would cost you. To be honest, I think you should be offering a drink to the poor to got to look at you. How else will they get through the day? You know, I may be a bum, but at least I'm not an... You got any gluten-free donuts? I have a brand new wallet that no one wants. Oh, a Ransom the Clown wallet. Thanks. Here's my old one. What am I gonna do with this piece of... Thimbleweed Park guided tours? You got any gluten-free donuts? Hey, buy me a drink? I'm not going to touch that computer. It's a big, ugly computer. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get on with my plan. I hate this town.
That worked. I have a blood sample. It's covered by the underbrush, but it's an old abandoned chainsaw. All gassed up. Sounds like someone in the sewer is playing the violin. I can't open that. That grate won't come off. I gave up looking at dinosaurs when I was eight years old, didn't everyone? It's an ice pick. This could be the murder weapon.
There's nothing up ahead but road. The town's in the other direction. Excuse me. Be with you in a second. I'm in the middle of sorting. How can I help? I'm a federal agent. Know anything about the body out by the bridge? You're a federal agent? I work for Uncle Sam, too. As one government agent to another, I'll do what I can to assist. Do you know anything about the body out by the bridge? No, everyone in town is still collecting their mail as usual. No one from my route is missing, and I would definitely notice if they were. I mean, not to brag, but I did consider joining the feds. It's just not as prestigious or as challenging as postal work. Know any good postal jokes? Oh, you bet I do. Why are postal workers such great comedians? They have a special delivery, huh? <laughs> Get it? Ugh, that's terrible. Why is there so much mail to sort when the town seems deserted? That's classified information. As a federal agent, you should know it's my duty to uphold the privacy and the sanctity of the mail. Unless it pertains to an investigation and you have all the necessary paperwork, I can't help you. Who is all this mail addressed to? I can't tell you. It would be a federal crime. I would assume you knew that, being a federal employee and all. Or is this some sort of sting to catch crooked mail clerks? Because I keep things ship shape here in the Thimbleweed branch, so there's no need to worry about us here. Tell me a good postal joke. What did the mailman say to the customer who asked if he could ship a donkey in the mail? They told her they'd haul ass and find out! <laughs> That's so funny, I forgot to laugh. Don't leave town. I have eyes on you. I'll be right there. Too much sorting to do. It's a sticky tape dispenser. That tape is for official government business only. But since you're a fed, just go easy. We're almost out of it. We should split up. Sure, I'll carry your crap.
It's working. The paper is drying out. Whatever, Red. Here's a bloody wallet. I hope you get hepatitis. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get on with my plan. Insert three reports from the Bloodtron 3000, Fingertron 3000, and Facetron 3000 into the Arresttron 3000 to issue an arrest warrant. It's an odd-looking plumber's wrench that says Wrenchtron 3000. Arrest Lily Tilio for the murder of Borisos. Oh, what have we here, Reno? Have our big city agent of Reno's actually solved the murder? I'll take that. Let's see what it says, Areno. Oh. Blah, Reno, blah, Reno, oh, blah, Reno. <gasps> ah, Willie T. Wino. Just as I suspected, Areno. Yeah, I'll be right back. Willie, you are under arrest, Areno, for the murder of Boris Schultz. Who? What? Come with me, Areno. Well, Willie Areno, what have you got to say for yourself? I didn't do it. Oh, yeah, Reno? These feds will break you. You want to close this case, Reno? Have at him. Do you think we should play good cop, bad cop? What else would we play? I'll play good cop. I'm the good cop, and she's the bad cop. <sighs> You're not supposed to tell him that. Well, I'm not good cop, bad cop. I did it, I did it! I killed the man by the bridge just to watch him die. 
clear your conscience. I also kidnapped the Lindbergh baby. Keep talking, murder boy. I'm D.B. Cooper and I stole all the money. Keep going. You're digging your own grave. I'm Jack the Ripper. Anything else you want to confess to? I took the beef. Blab on. You can't beat good cop, bad cop. I'm the Zodiac Killer. Keep going. You're digging your own grave. I, I killed Jimmy Hoffa for the mob. Anything else you want to confess to? I, I was the mastermind behind the Amsterdam Diamond Heist. I think we have enough to lock you up for life. You're going to the big house, Willie. Don't mess with the feds. I'm glad I caught the killer, and we can finally leave this stinkhole. That's not such a bad place. I learned a lot from working with you, Agent Ray. Yeah, I'll look you up if I'm ever at the home office in Albuquerque. Uh, there is no home office in Albuquerque. No shit, Sherlock.